pretty much all of the land is in the front yard and then all over to the right side all in here in into the woods a nice circular driveway three car garage Got some daffodils popping up. Nice country front porch. Closet. Gas log fireplace. These are real hardwood oak floors. granite countertops and a tile backsplash. It's all new hardware on the cabinets and the cabinets have been painted. All new light fixtures in the kitchen. This is a brand new refrigerator. flat top stove. Soft clothes drawers. Lazy Susan corner cabinet. Wall oven. Walk-in pantry. This is your laundry room. You have a laundry chute. Full bathroom. The cabinets have been painted gray with new hardware and tile floors. Traditional tub shower. Linen closet. the room over the garage. Lots of built-in cabinets.
These cabinets have drawers in them for organized. Gotta open these all the way for them to open. Lots more drawers. More drawers. a bathroom with French doors. Uh, this part of the house has its own thermostat. It's on a train system. And another really big bathroom. There is plenty of space right here to put in a nice tub or if you wanted to do some type of um, shower. storm door that goes out to the garage. And you have a real three car garage. This is nice because the stairs, like in most garages, the stairs will poke out to where you can't use one of the bays in the garage. Got two garage door openers. And then a little workshop area back here. And lots of shelving. And your panel boxes are over here. These are your HVAC units and your crawl space access. And this is your AC unit for the room over the garage. So you have a triple system. Closet, and they did run uh, ductwork in the garage so that it can be um, not so cold in the winter. screened in porch. You can hear the train. It's not terribly loud. <clears throat> There are French doors that go out to another access to the backyard. <clears throat> this is the master bedroom. Could definitely fit a king size bed. is like a, um, a vinyl flooring in here. These are newer cabinets in this room and um, marble countertops with double vanity sinks. Got a jetted tub. Separate water closet. New light fixtures. A walk-in closet. Got a 
under the stair storage. Your whole backyard goes to the whole cleared area. You do have a house behind you. And the end of the neighborhood is right here. So there's another house right there. That's your Renai hot water heater. So that's a gas instant hot water. So you can fill that big bathtub all the way up and not run out of hot water. Oh, one other room. This front room uh, makes a really nice home office or um, I think it'd be a really nice idea if you had a formal dining room to take this door off and you could replace this carpet flooring with the oak hardwood flooring and um, so it would flow really nicely into that room and put in a chandelier and you could turn that into a nice formal dining room. A different type of flooring up here. It's a laminate, kind of a gray color. Nice walk in attic. There are two bedrooms up here with a Jack and Jill bathroom. So each bedroom has its own toilet and sink. And then you share the tub shower room walk through. So this is the second bedroom. Little walk-in closet. These doors um, it's just extra storage, but they are painted shut, so can't open those. Got another, just another little closet with double doors. And at the end of the hallway, another walk-in attic. <laughs> 